I couldn't speak to a manager because they hung up. I called an hour later to confirm or if another staff would pick up. And then they said, coronavirus donut, nigga. <laughs> I had nothing to do with anything, but it's just it's just hilarious. Nobody wants the coronavirus, don't they? The fuck are you talking about? That shit stinks. <laughs> Yo, welcome back to another episode of One Star, bruh. Today, we're going to be reviewing Krispy Kreme. We're going to get straight into it, man. I ain't going to hold y'all up. I waited in the drive-thru for approximately 25 minutes and an extra five once I got to the window. This was what I was given once I did get my 12 dozen. <laughs> Them donuts look like uh, Sonic rings from the game. What a disappointment. First of all, the prostitute sitting next to the bathroom had the key. So when I had to ask her for it, of course she asked me for money. <laughs> Could have got you some Krispy Kreme. Some cream too. I came here. Granted, they're supposed to be 24 hours and a girl told me after waiting in the drive-thru for 20 minutes that they are out of donuts. How are you Krispy Kreme with no donuts? Then I asked, so what are y'all selling? She says, nothing. <laughs> nothing! Now get out! Uh, what? The cashiers aren't very friendly either. I get it. You work at Krispy Kreme, but that's not the customer's fault. Once I've served about 50 donuts for the day, I'm probably gonna be over it too. Like, oh, what you want? Donuts, right? How original. I've been there twice and they were out of glaze both times. The cashier acted as if she was completely surprised that anyone would be upset. And another associate opened the back door with a cigarette in one hand and donuts in the other. <laughs> Yes, nigga, I'm on break. The server had crumbs on her mouth and there was not a hairnet in sight. They were talking and laughing over the donuts. <laughs> next, next customer? Oh, no, nah, nah, I was eating lunch in the back. Rude and unprofessional. Clueless staff. I paid for a medium and got a small drink. And when I asked how come, cashier replied, take it up with Krispy Kreme. Nigga, you are Krispy Kreme. You, you're the representative of Krispy Kreme. He said that like Krispy Kreme was a mascot that you could just call up and talk to personally. Yo, this Krispy Kreme? Shh, chillin'. Waiting on this stimulus package, you know what I'm saying? This is not what I wanted. Very, very, very disappointed and angry. I'm almost feeling like a Karen. I asked for chocolate filled and this is what I received. There's no way you put uh, beans inside of a donut. Matter of fact, if this is true, I'm gonna launch a personal investigation. I will put hands on the motherfucker who puts beans in a donut. You need to be stopped. Stopped. Mortar was wrong. The cashier blamed me and didn't resolve the issue. I left so that I could avoid going to jail. <laughs> she sounded like my mama. My mama say some shit like that. Let me leave out of here before I catch a case. I say when prompted, I like two glazed white cream filled. The voice says, what you want? I say the same thing as I'm reading it off the screen. I wait three to four minutes and again, what you want? I said, I'm reading it off your screen. I'm not making it up. And I say it again. And by the way, I'm fairly articulate Caucasian. Silence. Another voice comes on. Okay, now what you want? <laughs> what you want? What you want? What you want? The service is doodle -doo garbage. It's not an adjective you want to be associated with. I asked for some donuts and the lady rolled her eyes and took a deep breath like she didn't want to be here. <laughs> While waiting in the drive through first he was ignored by the cashier. Then as we continue waiting, a worker takes a donut off the rolling rack and eats it over other donuts. <laughs> I went to Krispy Kreme at 2.30. The employee told me to come back at 3.30, so I came back at 6. So I got there, they told me to wait another 15 minutes, so I did. Look what kind of donuts they gave me. Does this look like a donut to you? This is the product of somebody on the last hour of their shift just ready to go home. I, I know last hour shift work when I see it. Completely messed up my order and didn't know until I got home, which is 75 miles away. Super unhappy. I'm not gonna fault Krispy Kreme on that. You drove 75 miles and not once did you look in your donut box and said, I should probably check these to make sure these are okay. Man, sit your ass down. <laughs> Found a big clump of hair in my coffee. Damn, Ethan. Sorry you had to endure that, brother. They yell at you to wear a mask even when you're wearing one and demand you make sure you keep it on. <laughs> so you're gonna have to have a mask on? I, I have a mask on. Sir, that's just your ugly face. You need a mask on. I told the guy who took my order to give me a second and his response was, your second is up. <laughs> they talking crazy at the Krispy Kreme. Four years ago, I was waiting to pay in a cashier and a Latina customer in front of me asked the cashier a question in Spanish. The cashier looked Latina but said, I don't speak that shit. <laughs> Why are you so proud to not know how to speak a second language? I don't speak that shit, nigga. It's English around here, cuz. The two girls in there were acting childish and so rude. Her name was Ganesa and the other one was the braided African-American who works in the shop. You need to fire a homegirl before I have my homegirl slap her shit. Man, your homegirl wasn't gonna do shit. Um, okay, so I showed up at 12.55 and this bitch was closed. The audacity to refuse me donuts during your operating hours on my birthday, Diego. 
Who are you and why should I care? It's a nigga's birthday every day, B. <laughs> you ain't special. <laughs> Drive by and saw this. <laughs> the employees that will handle your food are smoking in the garbage area. Where are they supposed to smoke it? I'm sure you don't want them smoking right in front of the register. So you said sprinkles, right? I walked in and walked out. They had bugs all over the donuts. F gross. I asked they had bugs. The girl says, yeah. Like, really? <laughs> At least she kept it 100 with you. You know what I mean? She was like, look, I ain't no company person. Yeah, we got bugs. Thank y'all for watching this episode. Another episode is coming next week. <laughs> make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you got your own personal Krispy Kreme story, make sure you drop it in the comments below. Also, make sure you follow the page on Instagram at one star bruh. And, uh, we out ya. The fuck are you talking about? That shit stinks. <laughs>